Why do we sleep? We don't. We have kids. And why do we dream? <laughs> <laughs> and why do we dream? Nice one. Uh, sleep actually. Uh, we, we were just listening on the the future of the mind. Away. Now they're figuring out uh, yeah. things yeah. about uh, why we sleep and why it's necessary. Oh, God, we're eating again. Dude, always add with food. All right, here, I'll have a couple friends. Well, he fries. didn't bring his do-it-yourself <laughs> foot or foot this time. <laughs> foot, yeah. Okay, so why do we sleep? What's the name I'm of trying that to place remember. Foot yourself. Felicious. <laughs> we should oh, really okay. open one called that. Um, <laughs> well, what did he say on the, 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 the about sleep? He was saying how it was. Uh, some, well, I can't remember. Clear out. Clear, clear out. out. Yeah, yeah, that was it. It was to clear out the junk. Yeah, of, like the the, the <laughs> mental waste. Yeah, I clear they, out my they, junk on a regular basis. Yes, he does. It's yes. your it's actual physical uh, it's stuff in your brain that gets cleared out as you sleep. Right. Well, they. Yeah, it's chemically Plaque, that sort way. Of like yeah, yeah, that was what he was saying. Yeah. That's there are quite sleep? a few theories that, about, about this. Um, one of them is also mind plasticity, about how you kind of reinterpret things that you've experienced throughout the day. So during your sleep cycle, you have time to kind of re redo your connections and your neurology changes some in the night. That's one theory. There's another one about uh, conservation of energy, which I think has mm -hmm. a lot of merit to it because scarcity is a big thing about you know wild animals hibernation so if first of all if it's dangerous for you to venture out at night because there are a lot of nocturnal predators out there you might want to just sit still anyway and then if you're sitting still you may as well go into a low power mode because your metabolism is going to be burning all this energy well that was actually what he brought up in the book is like what's the evolutionary point of sleep because it's been it's evolved by all these creatures yet what are you doing? You're basically becoming vulnerable right. to anything out there. So it has to be However, so important. If you're awake and cognizant, um, I mean, maybe you might evolve to sit there with your eyes open and be alert, but s stay totally oh, still. Our pet rats but that's sleep hard with their eyes because open. Because your, your muscles and everything, you know, you want to move around. Yeah. So I guess the alternative to, oh, the, to that is if you want to be silent. That's interesting. Maybe it was that. Not call attention to yourself. Then you just oh, kind of hibernate overnight. Interesting. So Snore maybe those like that a... survived were the ones that were able to like, have to stay still longer. Stay still longer yeah. during part of their life. That's right. And fewer of them got eaten by the T Rexes at night or whatever. So next yeah, one is. My mammals and my... Next one is large hairy <laughs> twat. What? What? 